As pioneers in the field of nuclear power, the export of nuclear technology is a major Russian policy and economic objective. With more nations looking at sustainable, emission-free and reliable power sources, Russia sees a big opportunity. Russia continues to be a major exporter of nuclear power generation systems and nuclear fuel, but wants to take it further. Here's a report with more details. Among the latest nuclear-powered solutions filed by Rosatom, the Russian Nuclear Agency is the world's first and only floating nuclear power plant. Named in honor of the 18th century Russian scientist Mikhail Lomonosov, the floating power plant is placed in the Russian Far East Arctic region. Amid the extreme Arctic weather, the floating plant has been generating power for over four years. The plant measures 144 meters in length and 30 meters in breadth with the displacement of 21,000 tons. With its two onboard reactors, it generates a total of 70 megawatts of power. 70 megawatts is enough to power a town with more than 100,000 people. As an exporter of nuclear technology, Russia sees huge commercial potential for floating power plants in several coastal regions. Floating plants occupy barely any land. They can be built in lesser time than conventional nuclear plants, while costing much lesser than their land-based counterparts. With multiple island territories and a long coastline of over 7,500 kilometers, India is among the nations that has expressed interest in these floating plants. If India decides to build these power plants along with Russia, it has the potential to further already significant Indo-Russian strategic and trade ties. India and Russia have a deep and wide-ranging strategic partnership and particularly in the area of nuclear energy, Russia has provided immense support to India, which is India's largest nuclear power plant in Kudangulam in southern India. This is built with Russian support. It's also being built and expanded as we speak. Recently, the Indian Nuclear Power Agency's chief uh, was in Russia. Uh, Ajit Mohanty was in Russia. He met with his counterpart in Russia, Alexei Likashov. And then they discussed the areas of future cooperation between India and Russia and nuclear energy. Some of the areas of cooperation included building floating nuclear power plants. Right now we're on Academic Lomonosov, which is the world's only floating nuclear power plant developed and designed by Russia. So in addition to this, Russia also plans to build larger and more capable nuclear power plants for India. So clearly, India and Russia are taking their nuclear ties, particularly nuclear energy use for civilian use. This is being taken to the next level with further ties between India and Russia. With video journalist Ajit from Pevek in Russian Far East, Siddhar Tempi, we on World is One. For latest news, download the Vion app and subscribe to our YouTube channel.